And race fans, you know how this goes. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it's time to drop the hammer. Out into the corner we go, got him two wide, three wide in the field, hang on to it. Robert Blue down on the inside, stocking to the outside. No racer way out of the corner. Jake Swanson swallowed up. Down out of turn number two and down to back straightaway. Kevin Thomas Jr. deep down into turn number three. And a 69 car looking to take over the captain's spot. Out of turn number four and onto the front straightaway. He's going to have a lot of hot company coming as he'll roll off the bottom and a lot of moisture, a lot of bite against the infield wall. C.J. Leary trying to follow him along. Sunshine slicing up through. 7BC car able to get himself into the number two spot. Here comes the madman up through. 12 car out across the nose. Picks up a position down the back straightaway. Hard down into the corner. Brady Bacon, the Macho Man, 99 car, working her tight to the wall. Watch the line by Kevin Thomas Jr. It's almost against the infield wall and wheels up. There's a lot of bite. Bacon coming to call now. On the Madman, Blue, keeping her out wide. The number 12 car loves Terre Haute Action Track, drives it very well as he tries to keep her gassed up on the top shelf. And down to the inside, that's not the lane to have. Kevin Thomas Jr. used it one time too many. That was important in the outside to 7BC car. And up to the point as they'll stay side by side for moments. Down to turn number two. And now here goes Courtney to the number one spot. Further back behind, here comes CJ Leary off the bottom. Number 30 car, quick down low at turn number one and two. Not as quick through turn number three and four. He'll get a little company to the outside. They'll dig it onto the front straightaway and a big sweeping move coming out of Brady Bacon, a macho man trying to keep that baby up to speed onto the front chute, almost ran out of real estate and tagged the wall out of turn number four. Move over flag coming out as Tyler Courtney continues to work it around this half mile track and continues to maintain the advantage of the slide job for the number two spot. And here goes Blue to second on the field. Kevin Thomas Jr. can do nothing about it. That was clean, it was fast, and aggressive down in the corner. Kevin Thomas Jr. comes right back at him again down turn number three and four. Up across the racetrack for a 69 car. Ballou will re-slide him, coming out turn number four, and you got a double slider, and Ballou goes to the wall and taps it with the right rear tire. Now comes down low to protect on Kevin Thomas Jr., and that is a great battle taking place for second on the field. Here comes Robert Ballou coming out of turn number two. He's running down Tyler Courtney. Courtney lies just ahead, 7BC cars across. Here comes Robert Ballou, got her gassed up and he is right there on the 7BC car. Lap traffic lies ahead, two car lengths the distance between Tyler Courtney and Robert Ballou. And Ballou's coming to the inside. No, Courtney down low. Slide job on the lap traffic. Robert Ballou keeps it down low on the racetrack. Coming across the stripe. Rolling to the white flag, one to go. Robert Ballou is there. He ran him down, caught him in the big run down into the corner, slide job up across the track. Courtney gets back around the outside. That was it, the haymaker. He's got one more shot, turn number three and four. Tyler Courtney was all by his lonesome till the final lap. Robert Ballou comes to call, can't quite get the job done. And out of turn number four, Tyler Courtney picks up a win at the Terre Haute Action Track during the NOS Energy Drink Indiana Sprint Week.